The situation with the Genshin Impact Chinese community angry about the Lansing Ride rewards has not been finished yet because in this reddit post, to be honest, I don't blame Genshin Impact Chinese several players being angry with Hoyoverse after reading Quike's explanation. And we got quite a long text from here, from the baby one something leak, I'm going to read it for you. First of all, thank you very much to Quark for giving me this information. If you don't know, Quark is a very big and incredible leaker. I recommend following him. Explanation in English. The catalyst for the incident was a statement made during a recent Genshin Impact livestream. Thank you, Traveler, for your years of companionship. Here are three fates, with spark collective criticism from Chinese players, other contributing factors include 1. There's a significant overlap between the player base of Genshin Impact and Honkai Star Rail in China. Honkai Star Rail often give out generous version reward, including recently a 5-star character's doctor ratio which makes Genshin Impact seem less generous in comparison. Number 2. Before the live stream, Many players believe rumors spread by marketing accounts probably referring to fake leakers or reposter about a free 4-star skin selector. These accounts tend to exaggerate the original posts beyond the mention 4-star skin selection, but the acquisition condition were unknown. 3. The 4-star skin selector was linked to purchasing a PS5, however, the Chinese PlayStation Store offer very few games, and some PlayStation 5 players typically switch their account to the Hong Kong region. Additionally, buying a PS5 just to play Genshin Impact is seen as a foolish decision. 4. The rewards for player return is 500 Pyro Gems, but the so-called Year of Companionship, I mean this year, only offer 480 Pyro Gems. This leads players to feel that the developers don't value their players. Currently, only the official Douyin account is losing followers. There's no apparent loss of followers on Bilibili yet, possibly due to paid followers at oh, and today's QR gift is 10x, which is yesterday's QR's per day. And yeah, I mean, we know we know for a long time that Genshin Impact and Honkai Star Rail reward are really different because as you could see in the next image here, like, Honkai Star Rail really give a lot, lot, lot of falls for free for us. And yeah, now, Genshin never had those, I mean, we got those in the anniversary or the uh, lantern ride, but basically that's it. And Honkai Star always gives this out in every version updates, which says a lot. Why Genshin Impact Chinese players are upset about it. And I got another one, like the Genshin rumbling has begun because in the Chinese, people are now officially official unfollowing official apps. Unfollowing company who collab with Genshin including KFC, Pizza Hut, and HT and giving a 1 star rating app on the Bilibili app. That's really, really worse than it is because this is Chinese we're talking about. Chinese players like never really had this kind of impact before, before Zhongli. But recent news about Genshin Impact is that revenue in the PlayStation is at 1 billion in its first two years based on Sony internal presentation leak, like you could see here. Genshin Impact. See? There's like a lot of them. And yeah, I don't know, like, even though that's bad, but obviously there's a market in Genshin. And with the Chinese players doing everything like this, I don't know if uh, Helioverse will take some account or accountability or change their word or whatever, but I guess we'll see. What do you think about today's news? Let me know in the comments down below. I'll see you in the next video. Bye!